Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest on 2K in existence. I'm finna tell y'all how to never lose badges in NBA 2K24. I know this is a problem. You all are facing. I have the secret sauce. We also got some devs tripping on this hole, right? Before we get into all that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe if you are new. Help me hit 278k.7. We are like 55 subscribers away, and make sure you hit that goddamn like button. It's free! Now, firstly, Nate XE tweets out, I wake up to badge regression. This game is literally going backwards. Y'all let me know if y'all if y'all have noticed this. He said even if you hit it max, it still go down. He says that Hall of Fame Limitless, he wake up the next day and it's bronze. See Hoops comments, looks to me like you stopped using it frequently a long time ago. Making one every few games isn't gonna get you past bronze, right? So someone's lying here or someone, or there's some type of glitch going on, something. I don't know what's going on, maybe uh, Nade's just being sarcastic, or I, I don't know, I don't know. But then, Nade XE says, turn that dumb feature off. No one wants to lose badges for no reason. L fucking devs, once again, do a better job, he says. Nah. Then he says, <laughs> now look, now look, look, this is, this is, this ego, man. It's like, it's like, it's like, for instance, but before we go over this more, I'm doing polls. Now, I'm indifferent about the badge thing, right? Because I know it's broken. It's literally broken. So no one can say they love it. If they say they love it, they're a bot. They're a double twister. They want to get on their knees and mouth wide open. Ah, please, please. They're begging for it. They want it bad, okay? They're trying to unlock forbidden badges okay if you're saying you like like the badge bro the badge system is bro you can't say you like something that's broken bro okay it literally does not work it's literally so i'm indifferent about it i'm waiting until like it's fixed completely then we're gonna see how it rock right but a lot of y'all y'all just be talking too much it's so weird you really show who you are by how you double twist things. You feel me? This is how you treat everything in your life and I feel bad for you, right? But it's like, for instance, I'm doing polls and most people are saying they dislike this badge thing, right? So it's like, if it comes to a time to where, okay, everything's working correctly and the whole, most of the community is saying, we don't like this, take it out. And they don't listen because they have an image for the game, but the people who buy the game are saying, hey, we don't like this. And you still keep it like a certain way. That's weird. You feel me? Peep, it's like, it's like they don't be listening to the community. They only listen when it fits their image, right? And I, I don't think that's, I don't think that's good, you know, but hey. That, that's just an example. There's several other things, you know. But yeah, Nate says, I hope you get fired, bum ass dev. Hey, W from Nate, okay? He's actually one of the few creators because 95% of the creators do not keep it 100. They all, you know, <laughs> at least he's 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 being honest, right? He has enough goal to, to say this to a, to a dev, you feel me? But he says, if you need some tips on how to shoot well enough to keep limitless, let me know. Sounds like your struggle is real. Now look, Zach, you're not good at the game. Okay, people might find this funny. You know, there's a lot of people who hate creators because of envy and all that. You know, there's a lot of people who just, you know, the the majority casual side, they, they like this, right? They like a person who sucks at a game telling someone who's actually good at the game likes things like this that's crazy to me like you won't come play you feel me so it's like watch your mouth it's just like this whole internet thing like people talk and you would never say that in person you feel me i don't like stuff like that you won't even get on the game and get in the field like you saying you offering tips you're not like that you're not him we, we can't see y'all's gameplay so y'all need to stay in your place and look look at demi demi did the same thing when uh ld want to come under my tweet and say casual right you know all fun and games but he want to he want to do this uh same meme but it's like bro you the casual and i'm i'm <laughs> 
I'm the greatest. 96 plus win percent every year, no try. Beating so many 2K league people, so many top stage players, greatest 2K players ever, all documented on the two. Okay, so it's like, you know, it's, it's, it's cool, but it's like, you know, it's like, it's like, it's like, I don't remember what I was talking about, but it's like, you know, the, the LD thing was, was, it was, it was okay, but then the extra stuff from the, from the Demi, you know? It's like they trying to pile on and shift the narrative to, you know, like devs over here clapping back and stuff. But it's, I, I don't know. I don't like it. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it, man. But Nate again, being real, speaking his truth. A lot of creators wouldn't have did this. He says, you got everyone laughing with this one. Unk, old head of death. You need to be fired too. Terrible next maker. Y'all believe Uncle Demi should be fired? I do think he's a terrible Knicks maker, okay? I do agree with that. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about that. Y'all y'all need to appreciate people that are actually, like, honest about things. You feel me? Like, do y'all just want everyone to just not be honest? I don't even understand why y'all support people like that. It's crazy to me. Now, here's the hack to not lose your badges. Go play 1v1. You don't lose badge progress in 1v1 game now gv is saying you definitely gain so this is the infinite glitch if y'all want to become 1v1 players 1v1 is probably most toxic so you know i only only telling some of y'all if you can handle it go for it but they're saying this is how you don't lose badge progression but let let's see what gv got to say in this video man we got the stop we needed we just couldn't get the rebound you, you know what would help here is if if only I could have some uh, ability to steal the ball from him. Maybe I have oh. some steel badges. And oh. then I remember I do. I do have steel badges. In fact, oh, I damn. made this build specifically with the purpose of steel badges to help get stops versus these guys on uh -huh. the ones. But guess what? I lose all my badge progress. Every single match I play, I lose my badge progress. If I don't damn. play a post every single game, I lose my badge progress. If I'm playing guards that are so So may maybe his maybe his thing is broken. Maybe it's broken. Uh, I don't think GV's lying, or maybe he didn't notice. Maybe it's broken. I don't know. I've been hearing so many. I get so many messages from people, like y'all be treating me like I'm a dev or something. <laughs> like I, I know I'm the voice. I know I'm the voice. I know I'm the truth. You know, but yeah. <laughs> people losing around, flying super fast, or hulking okay. on football. I'm not getting steals. How am I supposed to keep my steel badges versus those kind of guys? I'm not using them. So then, by the time I play this. Head, I don't have them available and I'm fucked. I've earned rights to gripper 100 times. What? Oh, so he probably plays 2v2s and 3v3s, but you know, but then he loses it when he goes play 1v1. 100 times I've earned the badge. I, I guess I'll just earn it 101st time. I am sure 101 times earning the same badge. What a blast. It'll be almost as fun as the very first time, man. I, I hope I get to earn it 200 times. I, I love re earning badges, man. What a great idea. <laughs> Hey, we got the stop we need. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about the uh, the badges. Oh, what? No, <laughs> what is this? I, I'm on a f win streak and I'm not moving around because I dig it. I goddamn, what the f is wrong with this game, dog? This is bullshit. What oh, Nate is hilarious for this. He says, you're going to end up like OG Constant, buddy. Have fun. Y'all don't remember the OG Constant guy. I think he got laid off or something, you know. Then I, don't, I don't know the logo next makers, him and the Mitch guy. The Mitch guy, horrible. Double Twister Hall of Fame. But the OG Constant guy, man, he was uh, spam liking a bunch of uh, pogs all on the timeline. Like... He, I guess he thought he had private likes, but <laughs> I don't know, man. So this guy talks about the ego of devs, basically took screenshots of it. Zach says, just some friendly banter. How is it friendly banter? To be able to banter with someone, you have to be on somewhat the same level. Like, you you not in the field. You know, you can't have no friendly banter with, with someone. You, you're not on the same level. You feel me? It's just like... A negative win percent can't tell someone that's actually good at the game to adjust. You you can't do that, bro. You you can't. If you are 50 win percent, 60, whatever, 70, you can't tell someone with an 80 or a stage player or, or someone playing pro-am or in the league to adjust. You adjust. 
if you can't adjust and play on those levels, you can't tell people to adjust. Do you not understand? That's crazy. You feel me? Especially like we're all playing the game, you know? So Jarius says, word on the street is Xbox players turning crossplay off and it ain't cause the servers. Uh-oh, who we talking about? Nadex, he says. <laughs> Yo, what what's been going on with Nate? Cause he he's going off on this. He he going off. He says you're another dick rider for a bum ass logo that has gotten you nothing in life. Keep taking L's, bum. Damn. I don't, I don't know nothing about this Jarius guy. Is, is he is he one of the is he one of the people? Damn. <laughs> Zach says, as 1v1 vets know, the gains are much lower. That said, the winning means a lot. So I guess if you win, it helps with the badges? I, I don't know, bro. What the hell does that mean? So this guy says, bro, I don't even want to play the game anymore. It feels like work. I literally have to do multiple things every game I play or else my badges will drop. I'd play thousands of games of Park every year since 2K15. This badge system is going to ruin the game for me. I, I I hear this a lot, man. It says, are you trying to progress? See, look, are you trying to progress every badge you have? If so, stop. Just play and your badges will match your natural play. People don't want that. <laughs> we pay a certain amount for builds. We want to get what we got. Now, look, people aren't realizing this, but uh, probably 90% of people, they're going to realize that they really wasted attributes going to certain areas because they're not going to be able to get it to that gold or whatever or a hall of fame or silver level so why even go to that threshold right it's kind of genius from a business perspective like this is gonna make i don't know if they directly design it like this this gonna make people eventually figure out like oh i might as well do this because I'm not even really going to use this like that, you know, or I can't even get this because I can't go for these damn layup badges and then keep my damn shooting badges. It's just impossible, right? But maybe the setters is going to change certain stuff. I don't know, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about all that. So Nade's also saying the delay. I'm also hearing the delay. I'm feeling the delay myself. Is this, is this the worst delay 2K ever? Like, I, I see a lot of people... I don't know what's wrong with it's like bro the world's finna end are we gonna like go out being real or what like is people like a video game we caping for a game people saying they gave you everything you wanted and you still complain no they didn't who the hell wants laggy crossplay who wants to wait for games huh just because they gave certain things that don't mean they execute my boy who the hell asked for slow molasses speed boosting? Who asked for that? Just because we said we want OP defense, that don't mean we want stupid slow guards. That means you put defense in the game and we got still fast guards. You know, there's there's there, <laughs> there's so many like, I don't know. People are crazy, bro. Like the narratives people try to do is insane bro I, I just i don't get it man nate again saying this should be free to play I, I also think it should be free to play it'll help creators and um it'll help 2k to be honest i think they just scared they want them guarantees now laker fan tweets out so when a guards complain every year that the guard lock big lineups are toxic biased against the pg because of plucks why do you never try running two ball handlers and dodging the lock and getting on the other team's no D guard? Now look, Laker, I know what you're talking about. I feel you. I personally like running duo ball handler over having a lock because my lock never seems to get stopped, so it's pointless. It's better to run duo ball handler and we play hot hand, right? I feel that's better, but you know, of course the comp people don't respect it, but look, this is deeper. This is deeper, Laker. Let's 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 go deeper, man. You 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 got Kobe on your profile picture, my boy. Kobe dribbles in front of people, my boy. He's sizing people up, my boy. That's what basketball is. Okay? A lot of the uh the casuals, the the old heads, all these people, like, bro, the how plucks are, 
it needs to be fixed. Kawhi averages in a 5v5 game 1.7 steals, right? You feel me? It needs to be fixed. <laughs> The steal success is too high, bro. As soon as I come on the court, people see Swante. They come up to me and they just press square. You feel me? Just because of who I am without even seeing me do a dribble move. Basketball should not be me having to run away from my defender because he's going to press square, right? That's not hoops. That's not why we grew to love this game. Y'all try to say ball movement past the ball and all this and that, bro. This is not football, this is basketball. We dribble. <laughs> you know, you can have defense in the game without going up to someone and pressing square. There's no skill gap in that. You don't even have to get bumpy, you can just go up and press square. Come on guys, grow up, grow up, man. There, there's no benefit to being a comboer, to comboing, to being able to get open. You have to just run away from your man. You have to keep running away from, no bro. The, the, the penalty to reaching is not good enough. This is why someone could just run basically into you and press square. It's not cool. Uh, it's, it's not cool. And it's very annoying. I, I really recommend that you guys go play at a higher level as a guard and actually try to do a couple moves. And bro, just because you want to run away from the defense, that's, that's not basketball, bro. <laughs> you don't run away. Like you're just holding R2 away and do it like, bro, that's, 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 y'all are tripping, bro. Especially y'all that be preaching realism to, to not be for it for that. And I don't, I don't know y'all trip. You talking about a game to 21. So Zach saying certain badges are rare to get. Um, he's saying for instance, chase down might not go off one times in five games. So as a result, one chase down block can fill your meter 25%. So so he's saying it's accounted for, man. Hey, yeah, if y'all know anything about the uh, the badges, that's hard to get, you know, let, let me know. Trash, take it out the game. If y'all actually played y'all's broken ass game, y'all would know how 90% of players feel. But it's good because we're going to play it anyways, huh? And peace emoji. Huh? He's saying stop. I, I don't know. And to, to be honest, bro, it's like there's some truth in, in what in what he's saying. Like maybe not with this direct thing, but it's like even with casuals, if if casuals stop playing play now and they went and played someone a little exploity in the park or in the stage, you'll see what people are talking about. Right? I, I've converted so many people. Like you really see once you face certain stuff, you see it's like. If y'all are gonna patch the game because of the top people, then fix the game for the top people. You feel me? Like they literally patch like so many things just based off of someone that is 0.01%. So it's like, if you're gonna do that, then you know, fix it for him too. Crazy. Now Dimeworks says he barely greens a 99 free throw. I've also got some other tweets of people saying this, they, ha they have no green window and pit. Baluba saying the green window is pure. 2K Toots putting out videos shooting full court saying it's pure. So now people can shoot from stupid far back. I, I don't I don't know, but it seemed like the shooting's broken. Not I'm not saying it's harder. It's seeming that there's something broken. Okay, 2K23, the shooting was broke. It seemed that there's something broken. Okay? Some calculations that are just they just don't work. Hey. Y'all make sure y'all go check out my last video. It is the first eight way build in existence. You can get hoes with this build. You can do taxes with this build. It automatically does your taxes for you, okay? It is an eight way. Imagine the other ways I all only named two. Click the video. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. We're talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.